This is art that you create. It's very unique because it is only visible under a microscope. Correct. And Correct. these are very accurate uh, sculptures and depictions that you've done. Let's give people, we'll start off with just, we have some uh, photographs. We'll start with those and mm -hmm. then we'll, we'll look at some that are live. This is nine camels in the eye of a needle that you sculpted. We have here a girl, uh, next is a girl with a balloon. That is an eyelash. That's a human eyelash? No, it's actually smaller than that. It's a fiber off my shirt. That was a, that's a tiny fiber, and you created that girl with yeah. the balloon. You also did, you do uh, famous people. This is John Lennon in mm -hmm. the eye of a needle. That's correct. And you did a famous uh, iconic boxing match, Cassius Clay versus Sonny Liston. That's to show you the scale. That's a match head. That, uh, the, and, and that is how tiny this work of art is. Mm -hmm. Let me ask you a second. First question everybody has is, how do you do this? How do you, what tools do you use and what are these things made of? The tools, are, they're, they're very, I have all different types of tools. Some of them are, are made from broken shards of diamond, which I smash up. So I've got like a little anvil, a little hammer, hit it, and all the diamond, little diamond fragments break up into little splinters. Yeah. And what I do, I, I sort through all the little splinters, and I use one of them. So I've got a little piece of wire, drill the hole in the end with the finest drill you can get. But the drill wasn't fine enough, so I had to make my own drill and drill a little hole into the wire, then insert this little piece of diamond in, look like a little bee sting. And what I do, I, hold, I work between my heartbeat, I hold my breath, slow down my, 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 my breathing, and then I use my pulse as a jackhammer. Let me understand this, please. <laughs> Mr. MacGyver, you slow your heartbeat down yeah. and then you use, you're using uh, uh, such a fine hand that you, the pulse, your actual pulse is creating yeah, yeah. the motion that chisels yeah. the, the material uh, that you're but, working but with. Sometimes I, I have to work between the heartbeat, so when the heart stops, then I move, so I have one and a half seconds to move between it. Um, it, it becomes a, a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why? Why are you doing this? <laughs> I mean, that's the other thing. Is, is it really, do you enjoy doing this? No. <laughs> this but, is unbelievable to me. You don't enjoy it. I, I, it's it, extremely difficult. I'll tell you what it is. It's a nightmare when I start and a dream when I finish. So I have to look at the dream before I finish. Okay. All right. Well, let's, so it, let's, let's move on because I am fascinated. I want to see, let's see some, uh, some actual uh, uh, samples that you have brought. And... Um, Let's look at the first one right now. I think this is in keeping with the theme today. We're having a presidential election in this country. You will put this under the microscope. Oh, look at that! There it is. That is the head of a... A pin. Of a pin, and that is the White House. The White House, yeah. That is and absolute... if you look on your right-hand side, you'll see the president. What? Where's the president? <laughs> Why wasn't this impressive enough? Why did you then have to put the president in there? And who can tell? Why can't you just tell people all kinds of stuff are in there? <laughs> Why can't you just start yeah. saying, oh, and the four horsemen of the apocalypse are riding through the dining room? <laughs> can't you see it? Well, to give you an idea how small that is, that is smaller than a period stop in a newspaper. Right. Yeah. And, 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 and what is it made of, the White it's House? It's made of a, a piece of a, a nylon uh, tag, which is, which is like Kevlar stuff. Yeah. It's like a, a zip tie that you, that you tie... Um, you know, bags with and stuff. It's like a very tough material. Okay, let me ask you a question, because I am looking at the pin, and it just looks like a regular pin. Mm -hmm. You can't see that there's anything even on the top of it. It's absolutely incredible mm -hmm. that you made this. Do you use a microscope when you do it? Yeah, yeah, I have to, have because to. it's so right. small. It, it's just keeping your hands still and working between the heartbeat and, okay. and making sure you don't inhale your own work. What do you mean? You, in, you inhale your work sometimes? Yes, yes, it does happen. <laughs> Wait a minute, you have spent, you could, you could spend weeks making a White House? And, and then suddenly you just have a little sniffle? And it's in your lungs? Well, <laughs> well with this one, my antibodies refuse to inhale this one. <laughs> <laughs> they, That's right, you're they, clearly they from, it back. <laughs> you're from across the pond, but if yeah. What are we looking at right here? Oh. Wait, those are the three... The, the three little pigs. The three little pigs and the wolf driving a car. <laughs> Which does not happen in the story, sir. What? I'm... You have wasted everyone's time. <laughs> yeah, but he told the pigs that he was a vegetarian. Oh. <laughs> that he's not going to eat them. That but, is absolutely know. incredible. Yeah. All right. That's very difficult because I have to paint them with a the hair from a dead fly. This is the hair of a dead fly. I painted them with a the hair from a dead fly. The fly died of Why? 
the fly died of natural causes. <laughs> Who cares? I mean, <laughs> does the fly have to die of natural causes? Well, his family told me that his wife had left him and he had a heart attack. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Call so the I... doctor, Andy. <laughs> All right. We have a little time left. Let's okay. keep moving because I want to get, I want to show us, these are absolutely uh, fascinating. And I want to show a little more before we completely run out of time. Okay. Um, what are we going to see here? We have Little Shaq. Oh, well, this is Shaquille O'Neal? Yeah, I shrunk him. Uh, okay. Well, I can't wait to see Shaquille O'Neal. Uh, to... Wait, what is it? Uh, He's uh, coming. Uh, yeah, he what? Uh, right now, I'll just focus him. Focus him. And... <laughs> oh, my God. What's wrong with his biceps? <laughs> so everyone's a critic. I know. I'm giving you a hard time. You've made something that's microscopically small, and I'm you know, giving you a hard time about I, the biceps. I call this one shrunken Shrek. Yeah. <laughs> Wearing overly large shorts. Yeah. Uh, but it's... Uh, that's absolutely incredible. And then you. I think we have time for... I just want to show one more. You used a... Let's, let's show this one right here, because this is fascinating. You actually used... Is this a... You used a real found object, is that correct, yeah. in this one? This is a, uh, I may have to change the position of this one. Okay. Um, because it's, ah, uh, that's it. This is it right here? This one I call equality, because you can see there's a, there's a little black girl, a little white girl, and a seesaw, and they're both balanced, so I call that equality. Because, uh, that's racial harmony in the yeah. eye of a needle. Because. Yeah. Very nice. And they're not arguing over the seesaw. They're just wondering <laughs> why they're in the eye of a needle. <laughs> yeah. uh, all right, well, I think we have uh, one more uh, thing that we wanted to show, which is your watch. Yeah. You've actually put a tiny image in your watch. Yeah, uh, this is a, I work with a company called Grubel and Forte, who make the most incredible watches in the world. And I did a co-creation with them. Mm -hmm. This is a, a working um, prototype. And, and inside this, I've inserted one of my sculptures. Um, it, what I do, if people are interested in, in one of my pieces of artwork, it goes inside the watch. Now, this is the most amazing watch in the world. It's if incredible. You have look, if you have a look through the mi microscope in there, you'll see. What's you, this? No, no, hold it to oh. your eye. Oh, don't yell at me, please. No, I get nervous. No, no, you have to hold it to, <laughs> you have to hold it to your eye and have a look. Oh, oh, my eye. I thought you wanted me to put it in the no, microscope. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Eye. So this is just something... If you hold it up to your eye there. Yeah. Oh, my goodness, there's a little, well, it's weird to do on television something only I can enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> Folks, it'd be amazing if you saw this. Yeah. But you can't. There's a little face in here. It's absolutely incredible. So there's a magnifying glass. What an extraordinary gift. Thank you so much. <laughs> I can only assume that you mean to give this to me. Can I ask you what this is worth? Uh, well, if you wanted to know, it'd be about one and a half a million. Again, That's extraordinarily course, yeah. kind of you. <laughs> but, um, I mean, that, that, is, that is the price hasn't been sort of fixed, but it's around about that price. Yeah. I mean, it is the most exquisite watch in the world because it's, it's got my work in and it's made by the best watchmakers in the world. You know? <laughs> Nicely done. Well, in this economy, you'll sell plenty of them. Uh, <laughs>